All right, everyone. So, Lynn and Scott, hey. this is part two of what we got at the Glass Estate Sale. This is 90% off day. So I want you to keep in mind, this glass was priced and we got it for 90% off. All this glass. This just gives you an, a kind of a view of how much glass there had to have been there for this to be on day four. four yeah. Day four. Okay, so let's go through the glass that we got on day four of an estate sale. Oh my gosh, wait. Show them. <laughs> the basket. That thing's heavy. Day four, still available, gorgeous. I'd say that's Fenton. Um, I don't, yeah, I'll have to look. I have not had a chance to look any of this up though. But look at that blue, like I said before in the other video, he must have loved blue glass. I mean, just gorgeous pieces of glass. Um, so then, <clears throat> um, Cabbage Rose, day four, beautiful piece of glass. I like the bubbles on it. They're the, the they're little cabbage, they they're little cabbage rose. Oh, they're cabbages? Oh, yeah, okay. little cabbage rose. Pretty cool. Gorgeous, day four. Show them what you got, Scott. What right. else we got? We got a vase. Yeah, I don't know. Um, there was some collection that was with us that was Jane Seymour. I don't know if that's Telefloral or whatever that was done, but it's encased. It's beautiful, blue. I mean, and we're, you're talking 90% off. Like, it's still a gorgeous piece of glass. Um, so... And Polly Twist. Oh, that's cool. Beautiful piece. 90% off. I just can't get over this stuff was still there. 90% off. Walk by a little drawer and we'll have nail was sitting there. There you go. Um, two apothecary jars. When I grabbed them, I didn't realize this one had strawberries on it. Mm -hmm. And this one was blank. I mean... You weren't allowed to take a bag in any of these days. Mm. You had to like Just hold it, what yeah. you can and then take it to the table outside and then go back in. And I think maybe they kind of did that so that people had a chance to look at everything. Mm -hmm. Cause then you just couldn't grab a bag or a box and yeah. throw everything in from the table. And if you're loading a bag of glass, you're gonna chip yeah. stuff, and then you go, "I don't want it." No. Yeah, exactly. Kind of so you had to, you could only grab like you know four yeah. items, and then you had to take it to the table. Four mm -hmm. items, take it to the table. So, but when you're grabbing four items and you got like fifty people running around, you're, you know, <laughs> I didn't notice strawberries yeah. versus this, but still a beautiful right. it's piece of glass. Under, I mean, yeah, you it's you still take beautiful. It off and come up pretty, I mean, no. You probably good at all. I know, but it's still pretty. Yeah. I like well, the strawberries. Good. I just wish I would have grabbed either all strawberries mm -hmm. or all. And a little base, I'm not sure. Oh yeah, that's amethyst it. glass. Yeah. It looks black, but it's got the swirl in there. Just mm -hmm. absolutely gorgeous. That's pretty. Um, I grabbed a Royal Hager vase. I thought this one, I knew it was instantly that it was Royal Hager. I had a mm -hmm. Uh, ashtray in this pattern, oh, that bumpy remember, yeah. white pattern with the blue. Did it had, oh yeah, that's oh, been yeah. a long time. Yeah, right, right. That's why I knew it was Royal Hager right yeah. when I seen it. Show them that piece. Okay, I saw this. This guy. Yeah, he grabbed that piece. That's beautiful. Oh, yeah. so, a lot of Italian glass. Yeah. It's pretty heavy. I and I sold <coughs> gold genie bottles like that before for so mm -hmm. some really good money. Um, I don't know. What I do? Oh, <laughs> I got. I liked this because I liked the top on it. I just thought that was kind of neat how it had the top. Just probably a piece of art glass, but um, it's in a really great little pink color, so I really liked that. Mm -hmm. I grabbed that and well here I'm just going to do one other yeah. little piece of art glass that I had grabbed. It's really, they're well made because they, they got a good weight to them. Mm -hmm. Love the swirl on it. It's got a cute little yeah. spout. 
Uh, or yeah, it's yeah. got hand blown, so it's it's a nice little mm -hmm. piece of glass. I've seen these. Um, these are sitting in this tray. Yeah. King's crown. King's crown. Let me uh, pull up the glasses and dig a little, little sugar, sugar and creamer. creamer. Yeah. And they're in perfect shape. You can see them, and they were sitting in this dish, but it's probably a butter dish. No, it might be maybe, the set that it goes on. At first, when I seen it, it, I thought maybe it was I mean, a butter dish. They fit dish, perfect but... in it, and the, they all it all goes together. So maybe it's in, a, in the yeah, same that, dish. Yeah, yep. It, that's how it does go. Okay. I didn't. You showed me this. He showed me the dish first, yeah. and I'm like, is that a butter dish? And yeah. then he showed me the sugar and creamer with it. So then I was like, oh, okay. Well, that makes sense. Uh -huh. Another little. It's an interesting little bottle. Yeah, a little bottle that has its stopper still nice little okay. piece again like a blue color um the glasses you've showed them yet no we haven't showed no. those you show something else instead? no you can no. do those we got oh, because look these kind of go match it go ahead okay and we got these glasses here i'm not sure what they are yeah, I haven't had a chance to look at this. We have five of them. Yeah, five of them, though. Those are pretty, though. I really like those. Those would be great for oh, the holidays. Yeah, they're and they're really like an avocado green. Yeah, and really. look, this piece kind of matches it in a smoky. It's the same shape. Mm -hmm. Beautiful piece of mm -hmm. smoked glass there. Gorgeous. And I think this may be our last piece, right? Oh, no, so. you got those um, yeah, the wire stuff in there little things there so this is a nice melon vase probably fenton like i said i haven't looked anything up yet usually fenton is known for their little melon vases so nice pink mm -hmm. encased white needs to be cleaned up but it's like that peachy pink color um but nice size too on it so i grabbed that and then there's a couple little trinkets over here trinkets it's actually a nice little wire um coach kind of for uh yeah if you put uh it's to hold six like, glasses and a, a decanter bucket, or, or a decanter, ice, bucket ice bucket or whatever or... so i like the shape of it and i'm wondering i want to see if i can't find exactly what was in this brass container it's in great shape but um so i don't i might who knows i might be able to find something to fit it so i thought that was interesting and then you found a big plaque? Was yes. Brass? I don't know. I remember these when I was a kid. Bless our home. I don't know if anybody remembers these bless our homes when you were growing up. I think my grandparents had this. They might have even had this in the cabin above the door. Bless our home. So that's um, pretty interesting find. Oh, Scott found mm -hmm. one of his. <laughs> Here, people how much wrought iron. It's, it's iron. Hangs Who made that? It said on the back. It's uh, from Sexton. the 60s or something. Uh, yeah. Didn't we say it was? 1968 USA. 1968. Sexton, um, Prussian helmet, 1870. And it's numbered 427 on there. I can't, I found one that was on Worth Point, uh -huh. in, but none listed. So uh, I wanted to put it in the pole barn, but it would we'll probably try and sell it. I kind of screwed up because I went after this and I missed a, a vase that she sent me after. And I. He so, wanted yeah. that more than my blue vase. Uh -huh. Although yeah, so. I got lots of blue vases. But <laughs> I really, it was a taller one. It was a taller one of these. Yeah. And he stuff. grabbed the helmet instead. Yeah. So they said, oh. And then I turned, I thought I'd grab it. And as soon as I turned around, man, somebody already just come in now like, like an eagle with salmon, just nailed it. And I was okay, it's gone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I got my German helmet yeah. the white. <laughs> and and Scott at any sale that we go to got gloves. He did get oh, yeah. gloves. Yes, I did. Work gloves. He got gloves every time we go somewhere. He got gloves and he got a little stool, stool oh, yeah. old to, that's on wheels. It's in the pole yeah. barn. I can scoot around, work on the tractors and stuff with that. And uh, every time I can pick up good work gloves for uh, for twenty five cents, I'm going to do it because yeah. I go through about two work gloves, uh, two pairs of work gloves a season. Oh, and then we found in the basement, we found two shelves still in the box. Oh, yeah. They were like... Um, they were sitting on the ground for a while. They're just metal shelves. Like, you know, they're about, probably about six, seven foot high to assemble. Yeah. And um, But they were, the bottoms of them were kind of rusty, just surface rust. But somebody had grabbed a bunch of other ones that weren't, like, rusted. But, but they're fine. 
Right. They were a dollar. Yeah, a dollar. I'm like, the shelves are sturdy. I don't care. They're going in the garage. Yeah. I don't mm -hmm. care if they're a little rusted. For a buck, yeah, I'll we take grabbed them. two packages of oh. them. So that's what I'm doing Sunday. Put yeah. the shelves together. Put the shelves <laughs> together. Because we have some shelves that aren't wide enough. So we're going to like, yeah. I think we want more that we can just store more glass yeah. on that are sturdy, flat shelves. Yeah. And that's what those were, were flat shelves. Uh -huh. So those will help. For a buck, you can't buy shelves for a yeah. dollar. No, especially so, like old metal ones like oh that. No. Oh, no. Oh, I did get a daisy painting. It's oh, me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I grabbed a daisy okay. painting. There was one that I really wanted, but somebody had already bought it. But they had lots of daisy paintings, and they had lots of glass. A person after my own heart. Mm -hmm. They said, I heard a lady saying, though, that um, <clears throat> they were there for some other, some yard sale or something down the street, and... The, the rooms were literally in this house, boxes top to bottom. The entire rooms were boxes just full of glass, completely stockpiled full. Everything was in a box. You couldn't, you couldn't go in the rooms. They were completely just filled with boxes of glass. And you could see them like through the windows. It was just all boxes. And they had tons of... Oh, uh, I have paintings. a picture. I'll show, put a picture of... I wish I, I knew something about art. They had yeah, they had... Stuff. I don't think you really like... Oh. They yeah. had... Uh, um, I love... I thought daisies. I love my daisies. Mm -hmm. But they had... In the front of the house, they just had... Stacks. Stacks and stacks. I'll put a picture of the stacks of pictures that were here. I have no idea. I wish I would have looked better at the painting. But by the time we had rushed for all the glass, I just kind of wanted to go. Yeah. I was ready to go and I wanted mm -hmm. to like go through the art more because this some people had some yeah. beautiful stuff this one gentleman had a really nice painting oh my god some mid-century paintings that were just absolutely gorgeous probably mm -hmm. worth some good money but um I just mm -hmm. I was done I we had been there this was our second day and I was just ready to go yeah. what else you got Scott oh, I found like these Schlitz malt liquor there you go. Got to have. Because in the pole barn, I got like old beer cans like this all kind of strewn around. Who did the commercials for Schlitz? Wasn't that Bob uh, uh, Dean? Uh, oh, Billy D. Williams? He yeah. was, was Colt 45. Oh, Colt 45. And his friend Fast Five Freddy. Fast Five. Did anybody do Schlitz? <laughs> Probably. Was that a bowl? What? Yeah, it's did... a bowl. It's malt liquor. Okay, they did have a bowl. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Thought I remembered. <laughs> I don't yeah. know. Anyways, so that was our stuff from 90% off day. So look for these items at an at uh, at a live sale Tuesdays at 6 p.m. We do live sales, and also I do have a veterans um, drop sale coming up on Veterans Day. What the 11th? So there is a drop sale. I will put a picture of that drop sale here. You will find a lot of this because it's gonna be red, white, and blue. There was a lot of blue glass here. So look for that on that drop sale also. So you'll find part of it on the live sale that we have coming up on Tuesday and at that Veterans Day drop sale. So make sure you put that bell on so that you know when those videos drop. So this is Lynn and Scott from Halen Vintage. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe you guys hit that bell button bye everyone Thank stay you. retro my friends Happy see night. you soon mm -hmm. bye